ane kunka zane na kwa <laughs> hey massive celebration has begun to hit every biafran in finland as as united nations secretary meets with prime minister simon heba and i go and i do get a course we have stayed very committed in what we have been doing and I'm celebrating with beer friends today because <clears throat> I can remember back in the days when I keep saying that beer friends deserves some kind of victory many people called me and said i don't know what i'm saying if i'm not going to call it i'm not but now everything is falling into place there's more redemption there's more hypothesis more restoration and more victories if i may say we have continued in this part where everyone must understand that the game which is played before can no longer be played again and the reason is because everything we ever wished for everything we ever prayed for is gradually making sense and that's where the gospel truth lies. We have started very, very focused on our mission to make sure that we put Biafra in the world map. Come rain, come sun. People must understand this whole thing. That the mission to push Biafra finally to the world map must not be taken for granted. <clears throat> Permit me to say that this one victory that Biafran has achieved by meeting with the United Nations President is a great clap for each and every one of us. One of the greatest of its kind. So they can twist this theorem and put it wherever they want to put it. But I tell them with all sense of respect, this is no longer a time for calculating what shouldn't be calculated. But rather, it's a time for looking at individually ourselves and giving ourselves this very accolade that needs to be given. Omuchinake, Oruna no Mume. You can see that the celebration is already shaking Biafra. And is a surprise? The same country they despise, the same people they despise, the same people they say that, oh, you people cannot achieve this thing, are now achieving it with full faith. And one good turn deserves another. Because whether you like it or not, the wood concentrates in this very figure where things has now come to big victory. If in car atomo pieces, if in car atomo pieces, in this zoo, this zoo, this zoo, I'm gonna every time. Their friends are far ahead of you all. But still you will never understand. Each point, each time. Their friends are far ahead of you all. It's only going to take some time before you all will understand. That the games that have been played right now. is bigger than you all so someone ever has received the first paper 
it's a proof of Biafran referendum. And uh, this is as a result of how we have continued to chase this very freedom for a very long time. The paper has been passed, the first paper has been passed by the UN Secretary. <clears throat> and uh, we are expecting that three papers will be passed. And once three papers is passed, then we will tell you what is next. So, but <clears throat> as we continue to, you know, spread this wholesomeness and where the most important gate is being prolonged, I must tell you without dispute that <clears throat> given more and more desire giving ourselves what truly really matters in the chase of freedom that this one really sweet me down and that is why when i was telling you all to support simon eba with every strength you know that you have we we're not joking with it is it truth be told this very freedom that we are chasing. <clears throat> Most people will not understand it. And the reason why they won't understand it is because from beginning to the end, it has become one of the most interesting part of this theories. Making sure that your friends win, Putting Biafra in the world map and equally continuing to prolong what must be done is a big truth. And you know, one thing is that the world cannot handle the truth. And that's the biggest game. You must understand this thing in a very, very polite way. And by understanding, we mean everything goes theoretically, interestingly. Now they understand that their friends are no longer joking. And that's what makes sense. <coughs> Victory is coming.